Hey everyone, uh, Salesforce Shorts here. Um, in this video, we're just gonna create a Visual Force component that will basically be uh, called from our Visual, Visual Force page that we created in one of our previous videos. Um, yeah, so if you haven't seen that, feel free to go check that out. So basically all we're gonna do is we're gonna go File, New, and instead of selecting Visual Force page, we're gonna go Visual Force component, uh, give it a name. So like you can give this basically different names depending on what obviously what you you're putting inside of it um for this one here i'll just maybe put this as like input bar or something keep it something quite simple so as you can see you'll get apex um component tags here instead of the normal page um that's one way of knowing it's a component so next step is inside of our components we can basically put whatever we want. Um, we're not gonna put anything in there for now, but if you wanna call, or well actually, let's cut that out. Put that in here. So we've got our Hello World H1. If I go back to my Visual Force page, let's maybe put a header two here saying, uh, da, 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 da. Hello World. Two. Yeah, I know it's probably probably not the best thing I could think of, but <laughs> I'll just use that for now. All right, so we've got a Hello World 2 there. Um, so if I hit preview, we'll see our little Hello World there at the top. All right, um, let's just like maybe do, 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 yeah. So next thing we're gonna try and do is call, basically call this um, component into our Visual Force page. So to do that, all we need to do is put a little tag with the C, um, put a colon and put in your component's name, okay? So for that, we're gonna put input bar and let's just say, put some input text there saying um, from components. Alrighty, it's save. Hopefully we don't get any errors there. Uh, I'm unsupported. Input text, do, 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 do. Yeah, all right. Let's not worry about that for now. We probably don't need that anyway. So we've got a little component there. So if we hit preview now, and you go there, you'll see hello world, and then we get our hello world too, which is pretty cool. So it's displaying what we've got in our components and then in the Visual Force page, you can see um, the second part. So if we try to just ma maybe make this look a little bit better, I'll just put a break tag in there, hit save, preview, and boom, all right, now we have it below each other at least. And yeah, you can always just put a few more, more of these in and pretty cool trick for dev console if you don't know it's if you hit command a and then shift and tab this is for mac um if you're using windows hit control control a and then shift tab and then it's going to sort of align everything nicely for you all right so let's go one more time hit pre preview all right it's cool so now we've got a space there so yeah you can add more components if you want and then basically call all of it from your Vis visual force page and then customize it to whatever you need uh, if you found this video helpful, please subscribe and check out our other videos. Thanks.